Hey guys, so here's an update from Adobe. It appears that they just updated yesterday on October 28th. Generative credit limits that were supposed to come into effect on November the 1st has now been extended to January the 1st, 2024. So this comes as really good news. It says, note, for a limited time, Creative Cloud, Adobe Firefly, Adobe Express, Adobe Stock paid subscribers won't be subject to generative credit limits. To learn when credit limits will apply, check back here after January the 1st, 2024. Now, previously, this box used to say credit limits will apply starting November the 1st, 2023. One of the biggest reasons for this extension is probably due to the enormous amount of backlash that Adobe has been receiving from its subscribers and users. And one of the issues with this credit system is something like this, which I'll show you, for example. By definition, every time you click on generate button, it's going to use up one credit. And the problem is that the engine right now, as good as it is, isn't exactly perfect. And so you end up getting a lot of funny or odd images that just aren't usable. And so you have to click on generate again and again, sometimes dozens of dozens of times until you finally find the one that's suitable for use. Now, does that mean that I might use up 10 credits, 20 credits just to find the one image that fits and works for me? That seems to be pretty bad because if we're going to get 100 credits a month, you could easily use up all those 100 credits in one hour. But it doesn't mean that you can't use generative fill if you've used up all your credits. What it apparently means is that even if you've used up all 100 credits in the month within your first hour, you can still use it, but it might take a little longer for it to generate because you're not prioritized. So it just might mean that you have to wait a little bit longer to get your generated images kind of feels like we're going back to the early internet days when you used to get charged by the minute, like 10 cents a minute to surf on the internet. But now if it's been extended to January the 1st, we'll have a couple extra more months to play around with it and not have to worry about these, these credit limits. And we'll just have to wait and see what happens on January the 1st, 2024. Feel free to share your comments down below and until next time.